Happy three-day weekend, everybody. This is Chilled Old Gamer. G Gamer? Gamer. I wanted to show you guys um, Microtech. That's not always frozen, but actually it's quite beautiful. Probably not that cold here either. Let's find a place to land and we can take a look at this scenery here. see what we got uh, let's get a little bit more over here away from those rocks there's a nice place looks like perfect and we can use the VTOL if we want to vertical takeoff and lift Take our gear out. We'll switch down to the front here. It's level out. Right in still a little bit. Hope you guys are having a great weekend this is a far cry from where we were last time the ecosystems Oof. I need to wait here the best thing to do is when you are on a planet because of the hostile nature of star citizens sometimes is to go ahead and just turn off your power. Ah. Sorry about that. Yeah, turn off your power, but keep your uh, keep your shield on. Let's see here. Turn your engines off. Keep everything else on. Your shield, your power, and your weapons. Just in case you have to. Just in case you have to get back into your ship. And in case someone attacks you while you're out and about, then your shields will be up. Again, word of experience speaking here. But yeah, I mean, micro, micro tech is quite beautiful. Go ahead and close the door always, always cause you never know who's gonna fly in and try to kill you and take your ship or just try to just take your ship without killing you. I've had that happen too. Look how big these freaking engines are. Flora and the fauna, quite beautiful. Zero degrees Celsius, so we don't have a warning on how cold it is. Still got the wind. Makes me want to go grab the rock and do some dune bugging. No jump boots like we have in Elite Dangerous. Oh well. Think we can climb on something here, guys? There we are.
just thought I'd share that with everyone. So Microtech just isn't a frozen planet. Hope everybody has a day off tomorrow, because I do. My wife does too. Often wondered with all the technology that they didn't have a remote control button that you could press in your Moby Glass to open and close doors. It would make sense. Oh, you know what? We were going to see if we could could lie down in our bunk. sit down, lie down in our bunk and see if we can still log out and get back in. Here we are, lying down. Oh, okay, here we are, log out, keep your fingers crossed. Try it. They said they fixed this. Still showing them at the beautiful Glen Station. Hopefully, I won't have to start again. I don't know. You can't ever tell. Loading, loading. See, now what will happen usually is when you got into this bunk where you, um, oh, look at that. I'll be dang. It works. Excuse me just a minute here. Phone's not letting me do what I wanted to do here. Well, that's pretty cool, man. Log out, get up. Well, I'm impressed. Still got my nothing but my thrusters off everything else is on Yeah, Microtech's pretty, pretty lush. It's 
not into its frozen place. I got my new HOTUS in, look at that. Stick as solid as a rock. Don't look like I'm having a stroke or something when I'm playing now. up our call to arms so we can uh, get any bad guys we might be dealing with. Should we go after Irfan Dilworth? And that is a that's an unfortunate name. Yeah, let's try it. See if we can come become a better bounty hunter than we have been. That's on the other end of the planet. Probably so. Yep, that's on the other end of the planet. There is pretty hair though. When you're uh when you're in uh on the outside in the space looking at the at microtech, if you choose the reddish parts instead of the white or blue parts then this is you're gonna get a little more that's what I love about Star Citizen is that you can pretty much land anywhere you want and then Elite Dangerous you have to have acceptable terrain which you know Probably is a little more realistic with the spacecraft. I don't know. Never been in one, so. But like this little flat part of the mountain right here, we could pull up. Ah, oh, 30k. That's the second 30k I've had today. Way to go, Star Citizen. I'm going to switch over to Elite Dangerous, I guess. I will see you guys in a little bit. Later days.